हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू एमबीए करो ओनली वन वीक इज लेफ्ट फॉर कैट 2023 एंड इट इज वेरी क्रूशियल टू स्पेंड द लास्ट वीक इन द राइट वे सो दैट यू गो इन द एग्जामिनेशन हॉल विद अ पॉजिटिव माइंड सेट एंड आई एम श्योर यू मस्ट हैव प्रिपेयर्ड वेल थ्रू आउट द ईयर एंड द लास्ट वीक इज वेरी क्रूशियल सो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अ फ्यू पॉइंटर्स दैट यू नीड टू कीप इन माइंड सो दैट यू डू नॉट गूफ अप द एग्जामिनेशन in spite of your good preparation what happens every year is there are some students who prepare well for the exam and get tensed during the last few days and end up spoiling the exam so in order to go with a positive mindset just follow a few things in the last few days first of all do not take too many mocks now because uh, what happens is in case you get a bad score in mock and uh, that could demotivate you so avoid taking too many mocks uh, i would rather say just revise the uh, the questions that uh, you took uh, you the mocks that you took and the questions uh, you solved on them or in, even if you wish to see the new questions and mocks what i would advise is you can just skip 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 and submit the paper and then see the questions probably if you wish to see the kind of questions that are present in the mocks but i wouldn't uh, recommend taking too many mocks in the last phase because at times it happens that uh, you are unable to score well on the mocks and as a result you feel demotivated another thing which i would advise is reduce the time spent on solving difficult questions so if you think that in the last few days you are going to revise level 3 questions or solve something difficult please avoid that instead focus on easy and moderate questions and pick the kind of questions that you are going to actually attempt in the examination see you have uh, a bunch of questions available with you and uh, it is about all questions carry equal marks so if you pick the right questions in the paper then you are able to score well in the examination so try attempting more easy and moderate questions so that you build the conceptual depth at the same time you solve more questions and you feel more confident going to the examination hall please revise all the concepts that you have learned and do not touch any new topic so i'm sure you must have maintained some formula notebook and just go through it especially things like geometry and all wherein uh, the theorems and all if you have noted all those that help you a lot so go through all those concepts that you have learned and that will help you keep uh, things in mind and as soon as you start solving see a question you know how to tackle those questions in the examination very important thing is eat healthy and get enough sleep uh, in case you do not get enough sleep you tend to get cranky or your brain does not function well so ensure that you eat healthy don't eat junk food okay and uh, take proper rest you can have some exercise uh, a mild exercise just to keep yourself fit for the day of the exam ensure that you spend some time on your hobbies okay do those things that make you happy let's say if you love playing guitar you can play guitar if you love watching uh, some sport right you can do that if you wish to uh, play some outdoor activity you can do that or watch some movie etc spare some time every day uh, even if it is like say one or two hours a day for some recreational activity that will keep you in a positive state of mind and see it is very important uh, the academic preparation is fine which you must have been doing for a long time but uh, keeping uh, a good mental health is equally important which lot of students do not take care of Uh, they just focus on academic part and they do not uh, work on their mental health so it is very important to work on your mental health in the last one week so that you do not feel stressful on the day of the examination and you you know that you cannot prepare for everything okay there might be some uh, weak points let's say a few topics in the examination which you cannot prepare for so don't worry about that and also there can be certain things which might turn out as a surprise factor for you okay so be mentally prepared for that let us say you anticipated uh, uh, some questions from some particular topic to be easy but it turned out to be difficult so 
don't worry about that if the paper is difficult it is going to be difficult for all and accordingly the cutoffs will be decided so be mentally prepared for the paper and do not worry about those things which you cannot control okay and it's a level playing field if it is easy it is going to be easy for all it is difficult it is going to be difficult for all in the last few days i would recommend that focus on your strength by strength mean like whatever section you are strong at let's say you are strong at uh, vrc so focus more on vrc because that is going to give you an edge over other aspirants similarly let's say qa is your forte focus more on the section which you are strong at because if you give the same amount of dedication to uh, different sections uh, the one in which you are the strongest will give you more increment okay so ensure that you focus the most time on your strongest section so that you can maximize your score in that section and avoid any content on cat 2023 prediction ki score versus percentile and all those things let the paper happen right uh, do not uh, watch videos like art 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 kar lo che art art kar lo aise koi bhi strategy batate hain do not focus on this because what happens is uh, like if you go with that mindset right someone tells you that if you get eight questions right you get x percentile then you think of attempting eight questions suppose the paper turns out to be very difficult then even eight attempting eight questions becomes a challenge you deliberately attempt eight questions and end up doing a lot of negatives on the flip side suppose the paper turns out to be very easy okay and you thought ki acha unne bola tha art question kar loge the percentage aana chahiye you attempted only eight questions and the paper turned out to be easy and you could not clear the cut off so do not go by any those predictions ki 2021 mein kitna aaya tha 2020 mein kitna tha 23 mein 22 mein kitna tha because those are past year papers yes that could help you to determine let us say if you took a mock of cat 2022 you attempted previous year paper you wanted to check your percentile for that thing it is good but for future prediction it is useless so do not watch any such thing ki cat 2023 mein kya prediction hoga kitne kitne score pe kitna percentile banega that will come once the paper gets over so avoid all such content before your exam <coughs> and one ultimate hack which i will tell you is become ambidextrous i am sure you know what ambidextrous is if you are good at using both the hands with equal skills now how how the skill will help you in the examination is that's what i do uh, see like you get a mouse if you take paper, uh, the examination in front of uh, Uh, a computer right so uh, let's say if you are right handed okay and you write with the right hand and you have the mouse which is kept on the right hand side okay but what happens is when you are attempting a question you click you use the mouse to select an option click next and then you again pick the right hand uh, the pen from the right hand and start solving the questions so instead try picking the using the mouse from the left hand because if you become adapted you do not have to leave the mouse your mouse, one hand is constantly on the mouse and uh, you can write uh, parallelly using the second hand this saves i mean it's not a big hack but yes it does save you some time let us say even if it saves some uh, 30 seconds uh, or one minute during one section that could uh, that could be the defining factor right so uh, it is one hack which i use in all the exams right i use uh, i use mouse using the left hand and uh, uh, then i use right hand for writing so it saves me time because i do not have to drop and pick the pen again and again okay so you can try learn this i said that you should not learn anything new this is new uh, this is something new which you can learn in the last week and that will help you probably in the last question you will realize ki agar acha mere paas to 30 seconds 40 seconds extra aa gaye the that helped me attempt one more question and then you can thank me later okay so the examination is just a few days away just be relaxed for the examination in case you are preparing for cat 2024 or know someone who will be preparing for cat 2024 you can recommend mba karo course to them so these are the offerings that we will giving be giving in this it it will include 250 plus hours of live classes uh, you can get the recordings of these videos can be watched later topic wise practice sheets there will be a doubt resolution group and doubt session classes it will include 15 full length cat mocks and 10 sectional tests per section 
Okay, the price of this course is uh, 25,000. However, we are offering 20% discount uh, till 30th of November 2023. If you register early for it, you get 20% off. So the uh, you can use the coupon code early24 to enroll in this course. Okay, so uh, the classes will start in December 2023. So in case even after CAT, if you think of ki CAT achha nahi 2024 ki preparation karte, you are most welcome to enroll in this. Okay, so uh, last week for CAT, and uh, I'm sure you are well prepared for the examination. It is just that uh, uh, keep check of your mental health, uh, right? Do not uh, take too much stress for the examination. Just go with the flow, try to maximize your attempt, not thinking about external factors, and I'm sure that you will do well on the examination. So, all the best for CAT 2023.